this is my package not your package my package it's come via UPS it's made in China I've got to open it and more packaging magnets oh look at that now these hang on are to fix this so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all of these magnets out and replace them with decent quality I think these are N45H magnets which are more powerful than this and also the high temperature these aren't high temperature they're just normal bloody magnets so <sighs> lovely Phoebe Lou bloody what's it EV parts store you can kiss my ass I don't need you anymore I've paid the same amount to have these manufactured as you were going to charge me for one This might not be as easy as I thought. Oh. Uh, guess who's got this wrong? I mean, it might might be all right. Be oh. Right, they're off. Now I've just got a massive clean up bloody job to do. I don't know if that's just epoxy. Actually, I think they've just used epoxy look, so that'll come off. If these don't fit and they there's too much gap, what I'll do is um, what you have to do is, you, when you fit in these, it's positive, negative, positive, negative. So, in order to get these in, while doing that is an absolute nightmare. So what I'm going to do, or attempt to do, is put them all the same polarity so as I can see if they actually fit. Right, that's all cleaned up. Uh, I'm just going to wipe some acetone around the inside just to get rid of any residue. If I start there, not counting that one. One, two, three, four, five. There's 28 magnets in there. Well, the only other option is to shave a millimeter off every magnet. <laughs> what the fuck? Why me? <laughs> oh dear. Right, they're all in a strip again. I don't know. What my best option is, oh you've got to be careful. The, these magnets are absolutely ridiculous strong. 
Shit happens, always to Tony. I should have measured it. I should have taken the magnets out first, but you know, I wouldn't have had any photographs to actually send to those tossers, so I've, I've got no real choice. Um, they measured 12 mil when I measured them, but obviously I didn't take into account that was measuring on the top. No, measuring on the top, they were just over 11 millimeters, so I gathered that. Oh, I don't know what the f*** is thinking. Right, I'm going to put it to one side, I'll do it another day. I'm not, I'm not in any urgent hurry for this, I'm going to sell it when it's done anyway. Uh, obviously I've got to test it and make sure everything bloody works, but yeah, I am going to sell it afterwards. I've got another box, this is my, my other box. Not your other box, my other box. It says Amazon Christmas. And in my box, I've got two of these. Don't need that. These are, hopefully, the correct inner tubes for my wheel. They look a bit small. Ah, they'll fit. <laughs> I've ordered the wrong ones. It's so confusing with these tyre sizes. I honestly didn't... I thought... I don't know what I thought. Well, I've checked the listing. I've checked everything that I possibly can. 3.00-4 is a 10 by 3 inch. They are for 10 inch wheels, which is what this is. Now, this was the original one. It's a bit thicker, it's a bit wider. In fact, the physical thickness you can feel it's a lot thicker. I've got, I've got no tube, I've got to fit it. <laughs> See, I've got to put a tube in here and blow it up to the right pressure because I need to know if this is going to expand anymore purely because of the dropouts. Um, if it goes anymore, I've, I've got problems, I can't. I don't know what the hell I'm going to do. Because as it, as it is, um, I'm running on the absolute limit to how much I can get away with. While I'm doing this, I want to give somebody a shout out. Because I don't do it often enough. In fact, I don't do it. His name's Cameron. He's building an e-bike at the minute, uh, which he's doing MSVA on it. Look at that, I bent this screwdriver in exactly the right angle now. And I honestly, I, I wish him all the best, I really do, because he's built this thing Every single part of it from scratch. Did it all himself. So, good luck mate. I sent him some handlebars to help him out. Not not thinking that he'd even try them. <laughs> and he's fitted them. Oh, it's so good having a bloody split rim on this. I'm so glad it has. What, what am, I, am I missing something? I'm going to get the tyre on it as well. That ain't gonna go on there.